Hello, my name is Matthew. At SASSING, we use the word innovation a lot. What does that actually mean? Innovation is defined as the creation, development, and implementation of a new product, process, or service with the aim of improving effectiveness, efficiency, or competitive advantage. Well, those are a lot of big words. What do they actually mean? We ask some everyday people some questions about innovation to try and find out what they believe innovation meant. What does innovation mean to you? Well, innovation to me is just th that little bit of improvement to life. Uh, say like with engineering, you have that foundation and you, you see someone else's work and you're like, oh, I can make that better by adding whatever little equation you want and stuff like that. For me, innovation means growth in a certain aspect or area of an idea or an organization. I think innovation means um, finding new solutions to problems that are more effective and useful. What examples do you know of Saskatchewan businesses innovating? Um, in curling, we use what's called the online violation technology, and it was developed at the University of Saskatchewan. How would you like to see Saskatchewan businesses innovate? Uh, for me personally, as a athlete and basketball player, I would like to see um, easier bookings for summer camps and training sessions. Well, I would like to see Saskatchewan businesses uh, get more of their products in store, so it allows people to shop locally as opposed to uh, being forced to purchase products online. Why is innovation important? Innovation is important because it makes life easier for literally everyone. It's, it's just those little things that make life better. You may not even notice them, the innovation, but it is there and it does make your life significantly better. Nothing would change. Obviously, change is necessary in this part of the world. Well, innovation is important to uh, continue changing, to keep a curious mindset for uh, leaders of our future. Um, I think we need to continue to improve and change so that our products are always developing and improving. How has innovation affected you? Innovation has affected me personally through my school life. Like when I noticed the growth of technology being inputted into my school life. At the start, it was simply textbooks. And then by my grade eight year, there was laptops and computers everywhere. Um, I'm more protected in hockey um, from the new designs and um, pads that they've come out with. Well, innovations like making the little nuances of life better. So basically, if, if say take COVID for example, innovation is like adding sanitizer to, well, like you walk in, you sanitize your hand, boom, clean. Like that's, that's the little part of innovation with this whole situation that's going on that's really helped me out. Because I, I feel safer knowing that like I'm not contaminating people and then that little bit of residue that's on my hands, I touch something, boom, it's good. I don't have to worry about getting sick per se, yeah. it's great. When people first think of innovation, they often think invention. To invent is to create or design something that did not exist before. Whereas innovation is a small improvement on already existing products, processes, or services. So one does not need to reinvent the wheel, whereas improve its effectiveness as a whole. In order to be successful, innovation requires proper control and backing. It begins with research into the concept and thrives under curiosity and a constant flow of ideas. Innovation works best when it's human driven. This means focusing on the experience or relationship consumer, client, or user has with the concept. Finally, innovation can never truly stop. With the world changing at an ever fast pace, concepts must undergo innovation in order to keep up or risk being left behind. As you can see, innovation does not just affect one person. And that is why it is so ever important for Saskatchewan to focus